Hello everyone, how are you doing? In this video, I'll be talking about uh, this scope and extend keyword. And let's see, this is how we did in the last video. Okay, we just printed the two values, but we declared the variable outside and we used that in that too. Okay, now let's see what will happen. Suppose, say, if in the print this printing function if I give x a different value what it will do let's check it out see it printed 3 and 8 right so what is happening is even if you declare a global variable but this function will use a declared local variable here instead of that global okay so I think people got it here main is using the global x because it doesn't have any local x okay but the printing function has a local variable named x so it will not go to global x but print this local x so local x local variable has more priority than global okay if at all a local variable exists but here if you want the global only to be printed I'll be talking to you guys about that later uh, now and this is a difference one difference but whenever I see this 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 uh, now this video will print just three and both the from both the functions but whenever you have a global variable outside and then you want to use it in a one function like suppose if I want to use it in main it's good to declare in the main to that uh, some variable is existing outside and we want to use it that is by extern keyword what this extend will do is uh, it will just tell the main that okay I want to use a function I mean variable x in this function so I am telling you that it's an external variable okay and we are using it in this function now let's use here to int x and let's see the output see output is 3 3 the output doesn't vary because you just put extend extern will just tell that we are using an external integer named x in the function and many programmers use this whenever they are using an external variable in any function it's a good practice to use that and this is it for today's tutorial and in the next tutorial I'll be talking about uh, static keyword it's very important you guys don't forget to watch it okay